Fernie, aviation metalsmith chief. And from there, uh, I just got married just prior to going. Well, I was actually in school when I got married, which was in 1969. And that was, that was like, uh, when I got to A school, I had to go through A, uh, uh, it, it, the first thing you do is you have to learn how to be safe around an airplane. They called it A, a Fun P School, where you had to learn how to put a fire out on an airplane, you had to chalk an airplane, stay away from the propellers, and all that stuff. That was the first week. And then after that, I went into my specialty, which was a metalsmith. That was sort of like going to a trade school. I'd get up in the morning and I'd walk over across the highway and I'd round to the schoolhouse and sit in a classroom and then we'd go into the workshop and we had to, we had rivets and we had you know metal and we had to drill holes and weld and we did all that. I did that for I think that school was eight weeks, six to eight weeks. We came out of there certified as welders, certified as metal workers. And uh, from there, that's when I got my next orders to Lemoore, California, where I started that West Coast trip. Went on to my first duty station, which was out in Lemoore, California. Lemoore was a training school where I had to learn the A-4 Skyhawk aircraft. I was a metalsmith, so I had to learn how to change tires, brakes, uh, hydraulic lines, and mainly bullet holes and stuff that came back from Vietnam on some of the aircraft. So once I graduated from there, uh, we got orders to my first squadron, which was VSF-1 in Alameda, California, which is in the San Francisco Bay. 